Guys, Wolfie here. This is the Kaya's rework analysis video for the City of Final Fantasy Opera Omni on Global for the 5th of February 2021. Now you're not seeing me because I am on my way to work as I speak. So this will be the video on Kaya's rework. He recently got one with the release of his last chapter of the Global End of the Game. You guys knew the drill. Um, and by that, the pros and cons of his rework will be featured in this video. And I am going to announce that Caius will be the March Character Spotlight video, so stay tuned to that until I get around filming that particular video during the month of March. With that bit being said, the usual disclaimer applies. Any opinion in this video is my opinion and my opinion only. And with this video, you know, the whole thing with the secondary rework, where could it go if he were to get it? So with that, we're going to go into the Lost Chapter banner. Because that way we get to see, you know, what his LD does. And for the record, I do have Caius's LD. I actually had a pity it, aka LD PD number five. So with Caius, his character enhancement powers are available, including the one for the LD weapon. So they have been, uh, the way we're just going to jump into the LD weapon here is called a uh, Despair Blade. The ability is the Giga Graviton. And it's basically what it does right here. And this is prior to the MLB thing. So we have here the 1 out of 3, 2 out of 3, 3 out of 3. And now we're going to go into the information pertaining to his rework itself. So, so basically, the rework for Caius is the crystal take level 55 and 60 passes, which are the extensions for the first two skills, respectively. Now, for Pulsar, Pulsar Burst, which is skill one, he gets two additional uses. And the information in red is you see on the right. Now, with Aya Bahama, which is skill two, he gets one more use, and again, the whole aspect with the, um, and the information in red. So, in some cases, this might be seen as a minor rework. And what do I think about this now? Where at the um, opinionated side of things. So, before I get into the information related to both Top Area Troop and the City of Database website, will be in the description below, link-wise. So, now we get to what I think about Caius's rework. This is something he desperately needs. Because he had so many issues with longevity prior to the rework. And the thing with Caius now is that now he has his rework in place, and the LD is really helping him, you know, be a better character when it comes to varying fights. Now, if he, and I did this as a test run where, like, before doing this video, so if you were doing, like, the Diabolos runs, like, with Ramza, you know, as part of the farming team, if you put Ramza and Caius together, where it's like, you use it, like, your main, the person in the party is Ramza, and your call ability is Caius, you have everything, you know, kitted up, all that stuff. This is where the, um, where Caius' rework really helps, because it's like, you have a pretty devastating damaging, since the damage is pretty devastating tactic. Because, you know, Caius are coming in here, you know, doing a decent chunk of damage, you know, depending on, like, the difficulty, all that good stuff. So, it's one of those characters this is where, because of his entire kit, it really does fix a lot of the issues he's had. Now, with that being said, he is one of those characters who desperately needs the LD to be at his best. Meaning that he runs into the same problems as very others. Meaning that they're the ones who absolutely has to have all of their gear and sense of their past. Because otherwise, they're not going to be as good. And unfortunately, Caius falls into this sort of trap. And with the um, rework it's 
itself, you can see it's a bit more mining. And this could be good, this could be bad, it sets up it being quote unquote minor. It sets up only the two skills, none of the other passes. The reason why it could be good, it could be bad because, you know, it's minor on paper, but really good in action. But some people may see, you know, it's good on paper, and it only looks good on paper. So it's one of those things, it's like you have to, you know, think of, think, think for yourself and speak for yourself on it. Now, if Caius were to get a secondary rework, I would probably put emphasis on damage output, you know, make sure, you know, he can do more damage overall. And it wouldn't hurt to even out the skill to the skill one since the skill uses. Because if you had to use the LD, you probably would be fully focused on skill two in order to serve uses. So that's that on that. Um, I do have to get going. And the next video, um, it will be the least character spotlight video. I think I may have said that in another video, but I wanted to make sure I get the Caius rework in it filmed. So that way, I don't have to worry, you know, once the rework for Ultimecia shows up. Which will, which that will be the next rework analysis video, is going to be for Ultimecia. So that's it on that, and I am done with this video. With Wolfie here, signing off, I will catch you all on the flip side.